We thank you for your time, and with no further ado, my buddy, Mr. Bernie Thompson. Hello, how are you gentlemen doing? Thank you very much for coming. I know how hard it is to come out and to train. I work on cars also daily, and I go to training whenever I can. And sometimes nights are late when it comes out to training, but it's always usually worth it. I don't really think you guys understand what you really have. Jay is telling you this, but I travel all over the country doing training and working on cars, and there's no other group even close to this. This is a very, very unique thing that, he, that the TST members have in these four states up here because this doesn't exist anywhere else. And it's really great for you guys that you do have the ability to go to different types of training and to hear different viewpoints from different instructors. Something that might make it easier in your shop. That's what this is all about. It's all about trying to help the technician because cars are very hard, aren't they? I mean, we've got 40 to 70 modules on board, all interconnected and talking to each other. We've got basically a space shuttle that we all have to fix. So this is a load, and this is just like the hill, but now we're going to use a load that's going to give us maybe a light. Maybe we have lumination from the work being done. Maybe we have a solenoid or an actuator that's going to be in motion. The idea is, is I have potential here, and the potential difference is between this point and this point, right? It's the how much work. It's getting to the top of the hill. So on a good circuit, if I checked the input, wouldn't I have 12 volts if a 12 volts was applied? And on the ground, if I checked it here, I would have close to zero volts, right? And that's a good Basically, circuit. is what you can start to see is voltage is really the movement against, vo against resistance, right? If there's resistance there, I have voltage. And if the voltage is changing, it's the load and the resistance changing. And that's what we're going to see voltage do on a scope. We're going to see the voltage changing on our screen. And those changes, each change means something, and that's what we want to see. Now, the oscilloscope is a tool to enter into a whole different dimension of time. It's not in our time. In one second, I could jump over here, and I can move a few feet. And if we take John Force, and we take his nitro, funny car, blown, fast car, right? He does the quarter in four and a half, five seconds. That's fast, right? So that in a second is just a few feet. It's not even a quarter of a mile, is it? Where electricity would actually be able to circle the globe seven times in one second. And no one, no one is any smarter than anyone else. Never let anyone tell you that because it's not true. The bum, the homeless guy out by the trash can, he is as smart as any of us. We all know different. That's all it is. We all know different. And I know a little bit different than you, but I'm no smarter. No one's smarter. And what life is, is about sharing those differences. And I'm here just sharing some differences that I've seen in my life. And I hope they make your life easier. That's what it's all about. Not to bang your head against the cars, but to fix them fast. 